all right y'all flying with skates back at it again here with another great video for you guys today on this video we are on reserve i have been sitting reserve since 10 15 a.m scheduling just called me and now i have a two-day trip and then i have one eight day left but since i come in so early in the morning they can't use me so the trip is worth 17 hours and you get paid four hours for your a-day plus the hour i set standby so this trip is worth like 20 something hours so let's go to work so as you guys know watching my videos i hardly ever fly like regular position um when you are on a days you kind of don't get to control what you fly because you're on the mercy of scheduling um this is something to think about when you are applying for this job because you're being thrown all over the place let's be clear however i am flying in the back today Y'all bless me. I don't, I don't even know what to say because I don't ever fly in the back. On my last like flight attendant trip that I worked, I'm not for a week. I worked the same exact same trip and I was the A and I remember having a medical on this plane. Okay, Look at my getter leg. <laughs> this is the plane. We're taking out a, a 757 today. So this aircraft has one jump seat in the front, two in the mid and one in the back. I'm going to take whatever they gave me when I get here. So let's go downstairs. Oh, sorry. So we made it on the aircraft and now we're gonna check our equipment and wipe our seat down. All right, y'all, we landed in New York around like 10 p.m. Took us a couple minutes to the plane and we are waiting for our man. 40 minutes later, life of a flight attendant. Y'all said it would be sweet. Y'all said it would be cool. But here we are on the curb, looking like hookers, waiting for a van to arrive. So here's a little update. Our flight attendant, which is a great flight attendant leading by example, called Crew Assist or Crew Accommodations and got us a lift to come pick us up because why well, wait longer when you can get a lift picked up That's right. this is being a flight attendant using your resources communication skills being a leader being the daddy be different get into it y'all exactly if i was there i would say bye y'all <laughs> i'm just kidding i want my crew like that all right, bye. Thank you. Here we go. Great customer service. Thanks for being so quick, man. We appreciate it. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. We in the black truck. I see you, ladies first. Well, I'm a lady. <laughs> All right, y'all. We made it to New York. Ah! Why does they look dirty? I have all this energy, y'all. We're in New York. Same thing goes. I need to call them for an elevator. Uh, elevator. I need to call them for a refrigerator again. Okay, see y'all later. Bye, y'all. Mm. All right, guys, as y'all know, I went to bed super late last night. This is day two of our two day trip. We have two legs today. Um, I slept the entire time because I have a red eye tonight. So I wanted to get some rest. So I can be like, active and aware on the flight this tonight. Oh, let's get into the video and head home. we to our hotel. Let's go. Grab your work device, AirPods and chargers. I like to pull all the sheets and pillows off of the 
thick just to make sure I don't leave anything. Boop, nothing. Also, open the blinds. Hello, America. <laughs> okay. I'm so excited, y'all. They have the best ice cream. I'm so excited. Ah! <laughs> we are on our long 757 Boeing aircraft. Still four flight attendants. Super long. I'm at the three left door. This is our little midget door. You learn about this in training. Who left his present? We go back to our galley. We have our emergency equipment all in one bin area. It's so hot on this plane. Look at these old school ovens. It's our four left door on a 757. It's one of my favorite planes. It's old, but I like her. It is burning up, y'all. It's so hot. So if I didn't say put their bags away here. Your arm rests in an upright and resting position, and your head rests lower. You can see the good amount of extension arm rest. Please don't at this time. <laughs> Get up, man. All right, y'all. We just finished our JFK to Phoenix flight. We have one more leg to go. This flight should be about three hours, maybe four, 340 probably. And it's really empty. It's 68 passengers in the main cabin, 16 in the front, and then one in comfort. So let's go.